tie has how many first place votes? Two. So two first place votes. And then pizza has how many first place votes? It's also two. And then tacos and then burgers was last. So tacos has zero first place votes, right? And then burgers has one first place vote. Right. And so what you would do at this stage is you eliminate the candidate with the least number of first place votes. So that means we're going to eliminate tacos and burgers. After you do a couple of these, you know, you can use the same uh, preference chart uh, and just like write on it. But that being said, so let's put all the foods, Thai, pizza, and burgers. Notice that there's no tacos anymore because we eliminated, we eliminated that and we've got people A, B, C, and D, and E. So what would the preference is a person A, B now? So they still rank Thai first place and pizza second place. If you've eliminated something, everything below it in your preference rises up a little bit, right? So now burgers are preferred third place for person A. Person B ranks tacos fourth place, so that means the numbers don't change, right? So pizza is gonna be first place for person C. Person C had tacos as their second choice. So if that's eliminated, their new second choice is tacos. And then their new third choice is burgers. Let's see, person D, that'll be one, two, three. And then person E, well, let's see, pizza was number one. And then let's see, it's gonna be two and three. Person E was the same thing as person C, right? And then we're simply gonna repeat it. So now Thai, Thai food gets two first place votes, right? So two first place votes. Pizza gets how many first place votes now? Two first place. And then burgers gets one first place. So eliminate burgers and then make a new preference chart again. But this will be the last preference chart. We got Thai or pizza and then people A, B, C, D, and E. So let's see, what's person A's preference? Thai. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We eliminate burgers. So notice the rankings don't change, right? So one, two. And then what about for person B? Well, we eliminated their most preferred thing, right? So that means everything is gonna rise up. So pizza is their first and now Thai is their second. And then what about person C? Every other person, we're eliminating their least favorite, right? So this means that we can just quickly copy that over. Okay, so who wins? Pizza. Yeah, so pizza wins.